Hi guys! I'm doing a live unboxing of Chimisu. I'm hoping I've said that right because I'm not great with pronunciations. I'm just going to add a few people and then once we've got a few people watching I'm going to get started. I'm excited about this one although I'm very hot. It's boiling today so I'm looking a bit of a mess because it's too hot to sort my hair and makeup out. Let's invite a few people. I'm not sure who's going to be around. Probably people having their dinner at the moment. I've already eaten, which was a bit of a mistake, I think, because this live is going to involve me having some tasty snacks. Well, I hope they're going to be tasty anyway. <sighs> yeah. Hello, Gemma. Hi, Katie. And hello, Kate. So, it's massive. I'm excited. Um, nice and full as well all right i'm just going to get you guys up on my computer as well so i can actually see comments without looking a bit special there we go right we've only got three people watching but it's really really hot and i want to try these as soon as possible so i'm gonna start hope a few more people stop oh you've not had your dinner yet okay um Paul decided that we were having a barbecue tonight, so I've eaten two burgers and I'm now going to stuff my face even more. <laughs> so I hope I don't make you too hungry. I'm not sure what to expect. I know there's going to be savoury and sweet treats in here. Um, so hopefully there's some stuff I like. If not, it's going to be a bit of an adventure. So I haven't opened it at all. Let's see what we've got. Say, look at the nice little chimisu sticker. <laughs> he might be able to. It's the little, I won a little barbecue um, a week or so ago, so that's what we've had. <gasps> it's absolutely packed. This might be me being sick on camera. I'm just going to turn the music off because it's annoying me. I can't be distracted from all of these yummy treats. <laughs> loads. So I'm going to try and do it without chucking them everywhere. But look, look how much is in there. It's exciting. So I'm presuming this is going to be, yeah, so this is the little leaflet that tells you what's in July's box. I think it's still available. I've been really naughty and I haven't checked the price of this box, but I'll pop it in the comments afterwards if any of you are interested. It's got all the kind of social media accounts there on the back. So you can kind of check them out on there and see what their other boxes have been. I don't know what to go for first. I think these look interesting. So it looks like there's two of these in there. And they say, green onion fin cracker. They look a little bit like Ritz biscuits. Luckily, on the back, there's a nice sticker with all the ingredients and everything in English, which is useful. So, I'm going to try some. Can't get it. Ooh, they smell yummy. They smell a bit like cheese and onion crisps. Or have you ever had cheese and onion cheddars? That's what they taste like. Oh, smell like. There's going to be a lot of this video of me just pulling faces and going, mmm, these are yummy. So, these are cool. I definitely buy these. They taste a bit like. I am going to eat my way through the box, Kate. I'm not going to eat every single thing because I'm going to be nice and let Paul share some, and I'll be sick if I eat it all. But I'm going to try a bit of everything because I think it's only fair. I'm hungry. These are lovely. So you get. I've eaten one. So you get five in a little pack, and there's two of those. So. 
liking these so far. I don't know whether I should go for something sweet or savoury next. Mm. Well, this is one that I'm not going to be eating. So we've got a nice pack of green tea, so I can have that to kind of wash it down afterwards. I'm not the greatest fan of green tea, but I'm slowly getting into it. I know it's meant to be really good for me, so I'm trying to tease myself in with fruit ones and things like that. Oh, these are cute. See, one thing I like about kind of Asian snacks and beauty and things like that is they have such cute packaging. So it is. Oh, I thought that said tomato. It doesn't. It's tahate. Caramel corn. So. Oh, no, it does. The English bit's been cut off a little bit in the printing. So I'm not sure. What's it going to be? I love to smell things, you'll notice that. Ooh, they look a bit weird. They look a bit like, kind of like a mixture between a what's it and a knickknack. This looks like the emoji, or the packet looks like the emoji. Oh, it's sweet. It tastes like sugar puffs. <laughs> mm, they're really nice. I'm going to put these away now because I'm going to eat my way through those. They're kind of like, yeah, caramel and corn. It's yummy. They do look a bit like a fork scratching. <laughs> they, yeah, I thought they were going to be like tomato flavoured crisps because I didn't read the ingredients and um it kind of looks like it should be tomato, even though it says caramel corn. Could be anything, but they are delicious. I'm liking this box, <laughs> can you tell? What next? I'm gonna go for the thing in the cute packaging next. And I think these might be a bit like, I don't know whether they're still around. When I was at school, I used to have things and they were like a biscuit that were had like chocolate in the middle. And they had like a little picture on. So I'm hoping, knowing knowing me, they're going to be like savoury now. I'm, I'm not going to read the what's on there. I'm just going to try it. I'm not very good at opening packets, am I? I don't really smell of anything. Yes, cartoons! Oh, I used to love those. We should get those for work. Oh, they're so cute. Look. They've got like little, I don't know, is it anime characters on? They're so cute. So they're flat. So they're not what I thought they were. They've all got kind of different pictures on. I'm not sure if that's sweet or savoury. I think I've seen the panda ones, Kate. I'm sure they've had the panda ones in one of these boxes. I can't tell what flavour these are. They're yummy. Everything's quite sweet so far. Even the savoury stuff has been quite sweet. So it's really lucky I've got massive sweet teeth. And this is kind of my pudding. Okay, so then the same brand as these ones. So I'm liking this brand so far because they seem to have cool packaging. Um, and the brand is Tahate, and these are meant to be savoury biscuits. Mm. I can't see what flavour they are. They're yummy though, and they're cute. I'd love to have these in like, I don't know, my lunchbox or something. That'd be amazing. There is so much more still in here. I'm going to go for the weird looking one. Okay. It doesn't look that attractive. Oh, Nutella and them would be amazing. I have like the mass, mass, massive addiction to Nutella. 
I pretty much have Nutella every day. Well, not necessarily Nutella, like different brands, but I always like have at least a little taste of chocolate hazelnut spread. This one doesn't look the most appetizing thing I've, ooh, it's crumbly, thing I've ever seen. It's like, it's a bit like a fig roll or something. It's kind of crumbly shortcake crust, shortcakey biscuit on the outside, and I presume it's peanut butter in the middle. It doesn't look like it does. Mmm. <laughs> doesn't taste like a dog treat. Mmm. 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 my belly in. <laughs> oh, that's delicious. It looks like a dog biscuit. It tastes like really good peanut butter in a biscuit. I'm going to save that bit later. But yeah, it is a My Biz Quit Peanut Crunchy Bar. Product of Malaysia, apparently. Mm -mm. I'm holding it upside down. Have I eaten dog treats? Probably as a child. We had lots of dogs when I was little, so it wouldn't surprise me if I ate dog treats as a child. Mm -mm -mm. There's so much to pick from in here. So I'm going to go for some that's definitely sweet. Well, I hope it is. They're all a bit like exciting at the moment. I've got Farm on the Road tangerine juicy jelly so it looks like it's i don't know if you can see like a chewy sweet with goo in the middle i quite like things like that so hopefully it's nice i love that look even on the little barcode there's a little tractor and a little tree going along the barcode see why can't our stuff be so cute Right. So, oh, it comes in a receivable packet because it's gonna last that long in my house. It smells. I don't know if you've ever had like mandarin or tangerine pieces in a can. It smells like that. Hi, JC. I'll um go through everything I've been munching on near the end it might be a while though there's a lot in the box so at the moment i'm about to try one of the farm on the road tangerine juicy jellies so i'm thinking that oh it's a little bit gooey i kind of see the goo coming out but it's not like it's more like it's got jelly in the middle than it's got goo, like, I can't remember what the sweets are called, but you get, like, round trees have got some sweets out that have, like, they're like bugs with juice in the middle. It tastes really fresh and, like, like the fruit. It doesn't taste like a sweet at all. It tastes like, you know, when you get the mandarin pieces in jelly, like the dull ones, it tastes like one of those. Random see. Kate knows all the good food. <laughs> I love it that Kate and Kate are like, yeah, I know that food. You can see if we're all foodies. What have we got next? So I'm going to stay on the kind of fruity theme and go for... I don't know how this is a serving suggestion. Apparently, that's a serving suggestion. But... Yeah, I'm confused. So these are green apple flavour QQ gummies. By, and the brand name is Want Want. Interesting. So. I can't believe there's like 10 people. Hi Mel. I can't believe there's 10 people just sitting watching me eat stuff. But I'm loving it. So, these are, let me see, tiny, tiny little apples. 
and they smell really fresh. I like it. Literally, there was nothing I've tried so far that I don't like. I love apple stuff. These are delicious. I don't understand. There's probably loads of chemicals or something. But I don't understand. <laughs> Am I making you hungry, Katie? <laughs> these, I find that quite a lot of chewy sweets taste like sweets and don't taste like what the flavour they're meant to be. These, like, especially these two, that tastes like tangerine. That tastes like apple. It doesn't taste like apple flavour. And I'm loving that so far. So, can I have a little bit of drink? Oh, Mel's shopping didn't turn up, so she's had to order pizza and is having to wait for food. So I'm probably making her extra hungry. With this immense box. So, I'm going for little things next. Look, there's another green tea. So we've got two lots of green tea, so... This would be great for kind of like date night or something. If you're like a feet, ah, your feet was your shopping's turned up then, has it? So I just think like if you you and your other half really like food or like sweets or like exploring things and you know don't know what you're gonna try, I think this would be quite a fun date night thing. Over that, or I'm just a massive fatty and think that eating sweets together is a date. <laughs> but there are so there seems to be like multiple of like at least two for the little things these I'm sure I've seen these before I don't know it looks familiar and they look maybe it's because they look a little bit like a Werber's seem like maybe they're a square Werber's so I'm going to guess or you could just look on the packaging they are a strong and rich coffee candy. Ooh, I like coffee. So I'm going to guess it's going to be like a Werther's, but... Yeah, I really think it looks familiar, Kate. But it's still looking familiar. But this says it's coffee flavour. <laughs> just, just eat with people. Mm. Oh, it's lovely. If you don't like coffee or coffee flavoured things, you're not going to like these. They taste. So I just, I've just, I'm on lag on my PC, which is behind my phone, which is filming me. I've just seen myself do my little happy dance <laughs> when I really like food. I do like a little wiggle. And I can't stop myself. And I've just noticed that I just did that. So these are definitely good. Um, if you don't like coffee, do not try these. They taste like the best coffee flavoured revel you could ever imagine. They are lush. Are you laughing at my dance, JC? I can't help it. Just... Whenever, like, I really like food, I do like a little wiggly dance. I can't be the only one, surely. So while I'm month wearing this, this, it's basically like a Werther's, but coffee and delicious. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Val. Mm. I would love to share with you. And, um... If any of you lives closer, that then I might do, and I might take um take one of these to work. I can't remember if she likes coffee or not, but if she does, I'll take a treat. So we're finally getting somewhere through this box. I feel like I've made a dent in it, even though I've eaten loads already. We've still got one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. I see I've eaten too much, I can't count to six. So I'm gonna get the bit out which I'm not gonna eat now. We've got a packet of ramen. I know ramen are massive in America, 
I've never really understood what the difference between a ramen noodle and like just normal noodles that you buy from the shopper. So it will be really interesting to try some kind of actual authentic ramen. Um, I know when we were in America, I can't remember when it was, last year? Year before? Um, there was like ramen shops everywhere, so this would be cool to try. And I might, it's quite a big pack, I don't know, might be a bit too much for me to have for lunch tomorrow. Anyway, I'm a bit of a fatty, I'll probably eat it. But um, these are not the nicest sounding flavour, I'm sure they taste lovely. But, and it's probably just like a translation error, but they're beef rind flavour. Which sounds pretty gross, but I imagine it's just beef flavour. Because it looks like pictures of like beef on there. And I love the little man. Look. Ooh, Nikki, I haven't tried a dust box yet, but I've seen like Mel's ordered them. And they look really interesting. So that maybe once I've worked my way through this lot, that might be my next <laughs> So, we're still munching on this coffee sweet. They're really nice. And I imagine if I hadn't have crunched it, it would last a really long time. And the flavour's still there. And it's not too sweet. And it's not too coffee. And it's just perfect. I love it. So I'm going to have a drink before I try these. I'm presuming... It's a packet of popcorn. Might be. Might be some kind of... I don't know. It says Regent Golden Sweet Corn. Um, it's got some coconut oil in it. And some artificial food colouring. So... Let's have a drink and try. I've just noticed that the expiration date on this is the 7th of October. It's not lasting till that long. Oh, that's nice. I like the idea of sharing one. I'm a bit too greedy to share one, I think, though. Oh, I thought this was going to be popcorn. It's not popcorn. This is what I'm like. I like the kind of like what I'm expecting. It's going to be one thing, and then it's something completely different. It is. Can you see, like, kind of puffs. Ooh, I'm trying not to chuck them everywhere. So, are they going to be sweet, or are they going to be safe? They smell like. Some kind of cereal I've had before. It's going to come to me. I'm not sure I like that. I'm going to have another one, even though. They kind of have like a hard outer shell. Maybe they'll be alright with milk. They're basically like a golden nugget crisp. <laughs> We've got four left, Katie. Mm. I don't think I like those ones. I'll give those to someone else. <laughs> Ew. Um, it's jelly. Apparently, I just picked it up. It's like squishy and gooey. This is Yuki and Love Mango Jelly. It's an unusual way to package jelly. I'm probably going to get this all over me. I don't know how to get in there. I'm sure I've got some scissors. This could all go very wrong. Yeah. 
I think I'm going to need some kind of plate because I'm going to have to try this one later. Yeah, they're like sweet, savoury, crisp things, the sweet corn one, Sarah. Look, this is like, is an action. I dropped it. Luckily, it, it dropped on a clean post it though. <laughs> oh dear. Let's just leave this one aside and try it later once I pick the cat. <laughs> anyway, it's mango jelly. I went to put this now. I'm covered in jelly. <laughs> Oh, I'm so special. There we go. Uh, let's, try, let's just try something. <laughs> so many, like, laughter, like, emojis just floating across my screen now. I'm so glad I am. <laughs> oh, dear. Let's try something slightly less messy, I'm going to guess. So these ones look like dog biscuits again. Yay! I hate that, like, I wonder where the dog biscuits look different. <laughs> Thanks, Katie. I'm going to get, like, the box session, like, live video award for amusing everybody. <laughs> anyway, going to eat some dog biscuits. <laughs> oh, I wonder if their dog biscuits look more like our food. Oh, I quite like so these are biscuit rolls. And they come in like a cute little box. And then something else for me to Oh I don't understand. It says to pull. I am um, I'm gonna chuck this everywhere, aren't I? Ooh. Ooh. Oh I'm confused. It's now like open like this. Smell yummy. More dog biscuits. They're kind of up there. They're like bonios. Is it bonios? Do they do ones that have got like the grey stuff in the middle? But it looks like wafer, and I'm hoping something like Nutella to get me over my face hurting from all the mango jelly. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh we have to put these away. But basically not as nutty as Nutella. But I'll let them just have the chocolate genus. And basically like a wafer with chocolate spread in the middle. Oh it's delicious. And Kate knows all the dog food and all the human children food. It's a bit bizarre. Right. Oh, we've got two left. And then I have to go because my face hurts. And my belly hurts. So I'm going to go for a yum yum. It's almost Kate it's colon. Colon? I'm going to do it in it like a... Maybe it is colon. Kate does eat a lot of children's food at work. She has a secret stash of Barney's at work. Although I have Pombe every day. I'm going to have a Yan Yan. And I'm thinking... I can't remember what they're called. Kate, Katie, help me on this one. What are those things that you can get and they're little pots and they come with a like biscuity stick 
and you dip it in chocolate. <laughs> oh yeah, Kate, it's Kate's birthday, she's being old too. So she has to be a real adult. No, not chipsticks. Chipsticks are crisps. The ones where you kind of have the chocolate. KP, that's it. See? Well drawn out. Mmm. Much better than the KP ones. Biscuits are the same. <laughs> Seriously. I don't know what you guys are doing to me tonight. I don't know what I'm doing to myself. <laughs> oh, I'm on the edge. <laughs> really nice. Anyway, I'm going to put this away before cake gets rude. I need my last thing. I feel quite sick at the moment. <laughs> oh. It's hard being an admin. They make you do all these horrible things and eat all these horrible sweets. <laughs> right. Last thing. I feel sick. Pocky. Looks like... Is it Mikado? Makudo? Moose something. I don't even know. I think I'm full of too much sugar and food and I need to lay down. It's hot in here. Here we go. It's going to be nice, isn't it? Ah, I didn't know that, see? Okay, <laughs> Terribly wrong. I think everyone should just get one of these boxes to just fill themselves with sugar, try exciting things. I don't even know, care how much this costs. I would definitely buy it just for the fun I've had tonight. <laughs> this is better than any night out. Ah, oh, right. This is almond. One, I really like almond things. I'm hoping it tastes a little bit like a dime bar, maybe. That would be good. I don't know whether I've tasted too many things, but... <laughs> I had two burgers before I started this game. I'm getting a bit sweaty. Can you buy them easily? I need to find me an Asian supermarket to get me some yan yan. These are good. I think I need to go for a lay down. There's been too much excitement for me. Right. <laughs> I've got the sweat. I've had to close the window because next door are cutting their grass and I didn't want them to think I'm a massive weird. Ooh. We'll have to go explore, Kate. Right. I'm gonna be professional. Go through the rest of the box. And um, let you know what I've eaten and why it feels so sick. Almond pockets. Loving. Ramen. Gonna try tomorrow. Green apple sweets. I can't even read now. I think I might have had some kind of sugar stroke. Like, my eyes don't work. Green apple sweets. <laughs> See lots of green tea. Maybe maybe the green tea is like some kind of like detox thing from the amount of sugar, 
random e numbers and um everything else that i've just consumed i think i might need a lot of this stuff <laughs> i can't help it kate i've had all the sugar peanut crunch i can't even remember what these are some savoury biscuits that are really cute this seems like a really good idea when i start it <sighs> green onion crackers i'm gonna have one of these these are really nice i might be sick give me an hour I'm going to eat some more. I might as well. I've eaten all the calories. These are delicious. Tangerine jelly thing. Yum. Ooh. Four of these yummy coffee things. Great. Literally a block of sugar, though. That's all it is. It's sugar with flavouring. This is what got me like this. sweet stuff like caramel corn sugar puff things I'll try and hold it in <gasps> um some chocolate colons <laughs> very yummy the delicious yan yan I'm gonna hide that in my bedside table infamous mango jelly <gasps> I'm not putting that back in the box something's going to go terribly wrong with that so what you're going to hear Mel's going to put an announcement up that I'm in hospital because like I've fallen into a sugar coma and I've fallen down the stairs and I've um, tripped on a mango jelly <laughs> if you don't hear from me for a few days you know what's happening This is literally the only thing I haven't liked. So, I've got green tea. I know what green tea tastes like. It's alright. I've got the noodles I haven't tried. I'm presuming I'm going to like them. I like noodles. This is the only thing I don't like out of a box of like a million beautiful, amazing, sugar filled things. I haven't even looked at the leaflet like that. I don't know how much this costs. I'll write it in the comments at some point. Ooh. So, they are introducing a new referral programme. So, I'm going to have to get everybody I know to um, sign up with my referral code so I can keep eating sugar. Because I think I might have an addiction after this. So, yeah. So... You get £5 for every person you sign up, and they get £7 off their first order. No limit to the amount, so um, I can eat a lot of sugar for the rest of my life. If I, all of you friends of mine out there <laughs> oh, sign up. So, it's just got a little bit about a couple of the snacks. Not all of them. I'm going to have to try and price this up separately. Um, I imagine with a bit of googling and things I can work it out when I write my review I need to go and have a lie down I've had too much sugar but I've had fun and it's definitely been an interesting Monday night so um, in future if I ever get given some kind of sweet box can you please tell me it's really not a good idea to eat it all on camera in front of everybody because you don't feel very well in the end. Um, but yeah, I'm going to leave you to it and I'm going to go and have a lie down. Bye! <laughs>